In this week's Problem of the Week, Wally plans to use 96 inches of wire to build the frames of two cubes, one with side lengths that are one-third as long as the other cube's side lengths. Our job is to find the total volume of the two cubes. Well, the first thing we want to know is how many sides a cube has. A more formal name for a side is an edge. And here we go. And you can see as we count the red sides, we're going to discover that a cube has 12 of these edges. And since the small one's length is one-third the large one, we can call the length of, the, of each edge of the small one n and the length of each edge of the large one 3n. And since there's 12 edges, the total in the small one is 12n, and the total in the large one is 12 times 3n, which is the same as 36n. We add those up, we get 48n is equal to 96. And we use the in inverse operation to discover that n is 96 divided by 48, or 2. So the small one's length is 2 inches on each edge, and the large one is 3 times 2, or 6 inches. We all know that to find the volume of a cube, it's length times width times height. But since they're cubes, it's all the same. 2 to the third for the small one, 6 to the third for the large one. So it's 2 cubed plus 6 cubed, or 8 plus 216, which is 224 cubic inches, which is the total volume of the two cubes and the answer to this week's Problem of the Week.